Take a picture. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Fabulous. This, you think, is enough? Yep. Oh, chicken broth. Oh, yeah. It is in a box. Oh, man. I have to... <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm going as slow as like. <laughs> so we cut up all the onions and now we're gonna serve the soup and garnish soup. I think it looks beautiful. Ready? Go enjoy your own egg drop at home with our little instructional video. Now, let us go back in time to July 1392, at the beginning of the Joseon Dynasty, when King Taiyo was crowned. Warning, pronunciation of this video may be incorrect. We are sorry for any inconveniences. <laughs> Step two is to fry our carrots in sesame oil and sea salt. And um, put the stove on medium. medium. Starting to sizzle. Our carrots are done cooking. I'm gonna, well they're kinda hot, but I'm gonna put soft. them, they just have to be really soft. So I'm gonna put them back in this bowl. Bit. I don't mean like, I just mean don't put a lot. Salt. Salt it up, baby. Our eggs, oh yeah, eggs. We put them in a skillet and we fry them like an omelet. And first you have to like mix it up so it's all yellow all around. Just like you would with like scrambled eggs or something. And spread it out. <laughs> She's cutting the egg into strips and but we put the, the strips are not working out. And this is the doll bag. Shiny doll bag. Yeah. I'm sure. Mm hmm and don't cover it all the way down to the bottom because then it'll fall out when you roll it. Next step is you can layer on your toppings. So, get like a slice of egg. Now you're gonna roll it up like so. This is the difficult part. Okay, then what you're gonna wanna do is put a little bit of rice here, so the seaweed sticks together, and you're going to cut it and slice it. It's beautiful! Look at it. Ready? Mm. This is a traditional Korean dress called a hanbok. Hanboks are worn by women ages 2 and up. On a girl's first birthday, they wear a doljanji. After that day, they are given a hanbok, which is worn for all special events and performances. On a hanbok, there is a top skirt, an underskirt or hoop, an overcoat, a traditional necklace made of cloth, a hair bow, and fancy embroidered socks. Maria, this is Chelsea Swan, and I have some breaking news to share with you. The Hangul alphabet, created three years earlier, in the Hall of Worthies, is promulgated by King Sejong the Great. This is truly a golden age for our nation. Hello, 
My name is Chelsea Swan, and I'm reporting live from the outside. With me, I have this fine gentleman who is telling, who is one of the creators of the Hangul alphabet. Will you tell me your inspiration? Uh, my mom and my cat. Uh, oh, okay. Anyways, uh, would you like to show these fine ladies and gentlemen your alphabet that you have created? I guess. Oh, okay. Now, bring it up to the camera and show them. Do you have anything you'd wish to say? No. Are you free this Saturday? Anyways, I just want to let you know that, uh, this new alphabet is what we will be using for the next forever, and I hope you enjoyed this thing, television newscast. Goodbye. This has been Breaking News with Chelsea Swan.